Hey guys, what's up? Um, long weekend. It was pretty good. Um, just putting on some lip conditioner. My lips are a little dry feeling, so this is seriously a really good product to have if you're, if you have, like, dry lips. Um, first things first, I'm going to find my primer. There it is right on top. VFX Pro Camera Ready Matte Primer here. It is a clear base primer. Yeah. And this gives you a really nice, like, matte finish. And um, doesn't give you, like, that silicone-y um, feel or anything. But I usually, like, put it right in at my T-zone and... Then eventually I will like put everything in place. Or how is everyone's weekend? So or how was everyone's weekend? Was it good? Was it meh? Or yeah. I am just putting on some concealer. This is the Pretty Vulgar um, Concealer White and Whiteless. <laughs> My weekend was pretty good. Um, didn't do a whole heck of a lot, but I mean, um, it was more or less um, spending time with family and um, all around just having trying to have a good day. Um, but yeah. Alright. Um, today's palette, I'm going to use our Iconic palette here. And it has uh, three mattes, a glitter, um, I wouldn't say glitter, but it's not really a matte either. It does have like some shimmer in it and it is a black shade, which is called black truffle. And then, um, eight shades of shimmers. So I'm going to be using this one today. Um, take out a couple brushes here. So I'm going to go in with this shade right here. It is called Leader. It is like this really pretty um, burnt orange shade and I'm going to just lay that right in the crease and get everything all blended in. But yeah, this shade is perfect for the fall. It is so freaking pretty. Um, I do use this quite a bit. Uh, hasn't been as often as I would like. This palette right here is $30.90. If anyone is ever interested in getting this palette, it is $30.90. And you can find this on my website, which I will link my uh, website in a little bit. I will put it on on here after I finish my live. It'll be a little messy, but it's okay. What did you guys all do on the weekend? Did you guys have fun? Where did you guys go? Congratulations. 
like I said, I really didn't do a whole heck of a lot to, this weekend. Um, I know this week is going to be a little bit busy, but I'm okay with that. Usually the weekdays are, like, are the busiest, so. And then on the weekends, we just try to, like, relax and not really do much of anything. But, yeah, <laughs> that is like our main thing. Alright. I'm gonna put some setting spray down on a flat brush here. And um, my first shade right here is called Idle. I'm gonna put that right in the inner um, eyelid here. Um, I don't use this shade that often, so that is one of the reasons why I'm using it. It's a really nice, like, pearly white shade. And I'm just putting that right in the inner corner. And then I'm using another shade in a little bit. But that's super pretty. I don't know why I don't use this very often. I just think it's really pretty. There's so many nice shades in this in this palette that I don't really use. And then went a little overboard. And then my second shade that I'm going to also use is this shade right here. It is called Passion. It's like this very light, um, light pink shimmer. And I'm kind of just putting that right in the middle of the eyelid here. Super pretty. I love it. Alright, and then I am going to go in with this shade right here. It is called Bliss, and I'm putting that right on the outer corner just to deepen up the outer lid. <laughs> Can't think of my words right now, I swear. Hey Susie. Good morning. Congratulations on Miss Braxton. I'm also going to use our Limitless Mascara, which is $24.90 on my website as well. This volumizes your lashes. It is like by far one of my favorites.
Now, I am going to be using one of our new shades. I'm going to try four, see how that goes. Um, so, I've already put primer down on my face. Um, I'm using um, the shade called Biscuit, which is number four and our, VF, our VFX Pro Camera Ready Foundation. Super good stuff. Alright. I just put some on the hand. <clears throat> I'm actually gonna... I don't know if this is going to be the right shade, but we'll see how it goes. Man, I'm like breaking out. There we go. I'll just um, use some setting spray to dampen this blender up a little bit and it helps keep your foundation stay on point too. Which would be nice. And adds like nice like hydration as well. If anyone is interested in getting some of our setting spray, we have the Time Locker setting spray. Um, it is like a really good dupe for uh, the Urban Decay All Nighter. Um, I've used it, I used Urban Decay a couple of times, but not very many. So I don't remember quite much about that foundation and also it was like a travel size it was more from like ipsy that it, when i had it but when i did it seemed really nice i liked it i mean it wasn't like anything bad about it so it just kind of reminded me of that that's what and that's what a lot of other people said too that it is a really good dupe for urban decay all-nighter if you do not want to pay all that money because I know Urban Decay is expensive. Urban Decay is really expensive. Now this foundation, once you let it dry and everything, um, it will stay in place. It will. Like dead serious. Because, um, when I was even sweating, dudes, it stayed. It really did. I want to quickly go in with some brow powder. Letting the foundation dry just a bit. I'm just kind of filling in my eyebrows.
Now this will also be posted on my uh, my YouTube page as well. So if anyone is interested in um, any pharmacy products, just let me know. If not, that's totally fine as well. All right. Um, my next thing. I'm gonna go in with some um, pressed powder and shade three. Kind of give that extra coverage. And also keeping the foundation stay in place. Not really in the mood to go searching for concealer, so I'm just using the Pretty Vulgar concealer again. Not like my biggest fan of the concealer, but it'll do its trick. Or the job, whatever you want to call that. <clears throat> All right. I'm also going to go in the BB powder in shade one as well, you guys. I'm going to just put that right under the eye area where I had concealed. And then I'm going in also with the 3-in-1 um, palette here. This has our bronzer, our blush, and highlight. And then I'm going to go in with some setting spray. Next thing as well is our blush here. And this is like the perfect, I feel like the perfect pink blush here. I'm also using the highlighter from here because super simple. And like easy on the go kind of thing. All right. And then after that, I'm going to be going in with some lips. Um, I think I'm going to go for BFX, actually, 
have our new lipsticks. Completely forgot. <laughs> Never mind. I'm just gonna go in with our liquid lipsticks here. And it just falls out. All right. I'm gonna go in with shade one, which is called Retro Rose here. Super pretty. This is what it looks like. And I like the rosy liquid lips. Okay, and don't forget, you guys, this does dry down to a really pretty matte. Love it. Um, it. Yeah, it just dries down really nicely. And it helps a lot with that lip conditioner that I just put down because, honestly, like my lips are really dry today. And I think it's just because I'm really thirsty or something. I don't know. But um, very good. All right, you guys, and that is it. I hope you all liked it, this live. Please, if you guys do not mind, like, comment, share, subscribe, everything. Um, it does help uh, myself to get out there and help my business. If anyone has any questions at all about any of these products, just let me know. Send me a message on Instagram, on here, on, you on YouTube, whatever. Just... Let me know and I hope you all have a fantastic day and I'll see you all soon. Bye guys.